Hi, Mr. Flowers. It's Trudy here. I'm nurse looking after you today. It's, I'm just having a look at your tracheostomy dressing there and I see it's got a fair amount of staining on it. Um, so we might get in and just change that dressing. Mm -hmm. Have you had it done before? Yep. And were there any problems with doing it last time? None at all. Good o. So if it's alright with you, I'll duck out, grab my gear and come back in and we'll do the dressing. Okay, won't be a moment. Okay, here we are. So before we start, I might just have a listen to your chest and just see how your air, you know, like if there's any accumulation of sputum down there and we'll just see how it's coming along. Okay, so I'll have a listen, then we'll make a decision. Maybe we need to have a suction first and then we'll get on with the dressing. Good hope. Nice, nice big breath in and out. And again and out. Just undo your button here if I could. Breath in and out. You've got really nice clear breath sounds here. In. Oh, okay, now I can hear that there's a little bit of sputum down in that base there. And again and out. Lovely. One more time. Down the bottom here. Lovely. Okay. Let's see if I can just slip in behind here. Can you sit up at all so I can have a listen to the back? Wait a moment. Let's be healthy here. Good day. I'll just lift your shirt up here. Okay. Now, once again, big breath in and out. And in and out. In and out in and out lovely very good thank you for that let's just lay back here i can hear that there's a build up in there because you can hear it as well with your breathing there can you feel it there's a little bit in there that needs coming out good okay so what we might do first is we might just clear that little bit of sputum out suction it out first and then we'll get on with the dressing okay. you've had this done before so you know what's ahead of you. Okay. okay, just pop that there. Now, last time when we did this, did you feel that you needed oxygen afterwards? Lovely, okay. On. Okay. Yeah, we'll just take this Swedish nose off. Just pop that there. Okay. Small catheter here. Okay, I'm just coughing now, a little bit of a cough. Excellent. Okay, take your time, get your breath now. Have a couple of breaths. Lovely. Did that get it? Excellent, okay. So you f how does that feel now? Okay. Let's have another listen to your chest and see if that's got rid of it all. I'll clean that cup for that later. Okay, let's have a listen. Out, lovely. And in, and out, and in, and out, in, and out, and in. Yes, that's made a big difference from my perspective. How's it feel for you? Lovely. Okay. Right, yeah, so we might get in now that we've got that sputum out of there. We'll get in and we'll just change that dressing that's there. Okay, I'll just duck out and wash my hands since we've done that, and I shan't be a moment. I'll open up my supplies. Did your wife come and visit you today? No? That's shopping. She enjoys her shopping.
Sailing, it's not expired. Good day. Let's get ourselves a fresh dressing. Some nice fresh tapes, ties are there. And dressing. What I'll do now is I'll just take this dressing off. I'll take out, give my hands a wash and then we'll get into it, okay? So it won't be a moment. I'll check the pressure of that cuff. I'll get the, the manometer and just check the pressure on that as well to see how it's fitting. Okay, that stoma looks nice on down there. There's no redness or anything there. It's looking really good. And what's come off on the, the the dressing here is just normal sputum, it's nice and clear as well, which is all good news. Shan't be a moment, I'll just duck out and wash my hands and we'll get into that dressing. Let's do it. Just a little bit of cold saline here, so just wiping around the catheter first and then away. Okay. And then just, just across the top here as well and down and across as well. Oops, getting stuck on the Velcro. more white. Looking good. I don't need to go and get those extra um, swabs to give it a clean this time. Yeah, sometimes we need a few extra swabs to get it clean. Dressing on now. Okay, if you can just tilt your head up for me. Look at the sky, the roof. That's good, it's not causing any irritation for you at all doing the dressing. Sometimes people can get quite a cough going on. That's looking good. There we go. I've got my sterile gloves on, so if I needed to, I can use, I could quite easily use my hands. That's okay. Let's get in and what we'll do now is we'll get in and we'll just change that dress, change the tapes that are tying it round. So, okay, nice fresh one, fresh tapes. Okay, I'm just slipping this behind your head here if I can. Thank you very much. And around. Thank you. Let's get 
I'm untangled here. Okay. Okay, I'll just tighten up this side. Okay, I'm gonna make that a little bit tighter there. One more moment. Okay, so I'm just making sure that I can fit three fingers on this side. Okay, so it's still fairly loose around there. It's not obstructing you. Now that I've got both sets on, I'll take those first old set off so that the new ones are nice and secure in place. We'll take those old ones off. Okay, won't be behind. Thank you for that. check the, the tightness of those ties now so I'm just putting the couple of fingers underneath here okay and I can see that that's not too tight that's happening around there okay how does that feel yeah. very good all right oh, one moment I'll just sit down <laughs> but you're going to shake my hand I'll take my gloves off first there we go now we can shake hands good on you okay thank you for that then Mr. Flower. Thank you. Give me hoy, okay, so because that's a new dressing on there, your buzzer is just with your buzzer just over the other side over here. So and make sure that you've got that handy. If you feel it for it doesn't feel secure enough or you're worried in any way, just don't hesitate to give us a buzz. Okay. Straighten your back up again. And let's be on our way. So you've got your buzzer handy. Be gone. Thank you.